Hello, how's it going guys? Thank you for watching. For this video, I'm going to do a taste test on this Fax Snacks Double Chocolate Chip Cookies. All right, she heard chocolate chip cookies and now she wants to end on this video. So this is a low-carb, sugar-free, keto-friendly cookie. All right, before I open this up, let me get into the nutrition of facts. So this right here is two servings, one serving per cookie, and that's one cookie is 100 calories nine grams of fat, seven grams of carbs. Oh, I see what they did there. So they're getting, they're getting smart. What they did is they put total carbs, seven grams, but highlighted net carbs for two grams. So from the seven total grams of carbs, two of them are fiber and three of them are sugar alcohol. And then there's two grams of protein. The top ingredients are almond flour, butter, chocolate chips, unsweetened chocolate, erythritol, chocolate butter, okay. So those are the th top, uh, and then it has eggs and other stuff. The packaging is cute. I kind of like the packaging. Uh, it looks, I like that it's see-through because you can see the texture. You can see, uh, you can kind of almost imagine the flavor and texture. And now it's time to really find out the flavor. All right, so I'm gonna open this up. Okay. I only have two cookies, so I don't want them fighting. Mitad, mitad, okay? Oh, the texture is really soft. Okay, mita. And then, le voy a dar mita. Maybe you want to try this one? It smells like a chocolate brownie. More like a brownie than a cookie. The texture is more like a brownie than a cookie. Like a cookie, to me, would be a little crunchier. Uh, this one, and the, where a brownie is a little chewy, this one is more chewy. It smells really good, though. It's making my mouth water. You know, when you use almond flour, this is probably the consistency that you're gonna get. Just because almond flour is mostly fat from the almonds, like the pulps from the uh, almond. And so it doesn't stick together like flour would. But you can see that they used butter on this. Now, the price here for those two cookies is $2.99, which is too much. But this is like a luxury when you're on keto, so I can see why. Mm. Good, I like that. I like that it's not super sweet. A lot of the, the products that I started eating in the beginning when I first started keto, a lot of these um, keto friendly products, they added so much sweetener to try to make up for the fact that people can't eat sugar, that they were overly sweet. This one's nice and subtle and, and, and good and nice and balanced. You can taste the chocolate, you can taste the sweetness. You can actually feel the the resistance from the chocolate chips, so that's good. Mm. Te gustó? Si? Te gustó? Milk. Quieres leche, okay? Me quiero con leche. Oh, yeah. It'd be nice with milk, which I do have a product mm -hmm. that was in a keto crate. It's macadamia milk, so I'll try that later. But yeah, that's a good cookie. I recommend it. The flavor is good. The texture is good. It's a little bit expensive, but everything that gets shipped to Hawaii is expensive, uh, so not much we can do about that. I do think that you can make this. It seems simple enough, you know, with some uh, almond flour, butter, and cocoa powder. I think it's something that I can make. Uh, throw an egg in there. And so I think I will probably make it before I buy more. Yeah, but it's nice to have when you're craving something sweet or a cookie or, or a brownie. I personally would rather make it than buy it, but uh, that's just me. Uh, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Please let me know in the comment section below if you know another cookie that's better than that or that you want me to try. If you haven't already, please subscribe to this channel. Hit that bell so you know when I upload new videos. I really appreciate you guys watching. Thank you, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye. Bye.